What's good, gang? It's your boy Black Genie, and today we'll be back with a new video, guys. Hey, yo, you guys see it? We over on Twitch with the gang. You guys see him say what's up to them, everybody. And we're back with some more Seven Deadly Sins. We kind of left off on some crazy stuff, guys. I ain't even gonna lie. I was kind of watching this episode again, like right now, so it's kind of fresh to me. Like everything is fresh to me right now. We left off with basically Esta Rosa is male. Hopefully, everyone here knows that. We all know that. But Estarosa isn't really a Estarosa. Like we've been getting it wrong this whole time. Like Estarosa is apparently a dog or something like that. And Gother had to do this crazy ass spell, which sacrificed his whole life to alter everyone's memory, even the gods. And watching it last episode again, like when we were like into it, and Meliodas' father was saying like, like yo, uh, I think he did it. He altered everyone's memory. Or like, or, like I think that bastard did it. I think he actually knows Gother did something, but. I don't really know what he's about to do, but at the same time, Gotha did say he's about to take care of this shit if Estorosa does anything, or male, but sheesh, I don't really know what to expect. Basically, male is back in the picture. I don't know if he has his Archangel Grace, because he has the same power as uh, Escanor, so that's pretty crazy. We have, what's his face in the building? Uh, Merlin out here wiped the floor with Zeldris, but at the same time, we still don't know what's going on there. She wiped the floor with fucking everybody, damn it. She wiped the floor with Kusak. Hopefully, she killed that motherfucker because she could damn near kill that motherfucker right now. She wiped the floor with damn near Chandler. She's still in Kusak's damn near mind and burning Chandler. So, that's just pretty much crazy. We all know Merlin's pretty much OP hacks. Uh, but at the same time, they gonna find a way to find to, to kind of nerf her. So, I don't think that's just that's just gonna be sweet over there. But I ain't finna say too much. We about to get right back into the 7 Daily Sin episode. You guys already know if y'all watching this on YouTube. Pull up to the Twitch, y'all see them spamming and shit, you feel me? So pull up to the Twitch game, we be having a lot of fun over here, and y'all already know, I ain't finna say too much, we better to get into it. On game. Alright, 3,000 years ago, the Holy War ended, with ghosts are using a forbidden crazy spell. Mm, it seemed like he knows, it seemed like the Demon King knows, like, it seems like that bastard, he did it. The curse has finally lifted after 3,000 years. Hmm, it's crazy. Yeah, it's crazy over there now. Yeah, I've got his wings. So only the people that know him are kind of getting their memories altered. He didn't know him, so... That's a, so never existed in the first place. It was always male. So, but at the same time, you guys know that male, even Angel male, it seems like Angel male had a crush on Elizabeth. That's what it seems like. Like, that's what it seems like. It seems like Angel male in general had like a crush on, uh, well, what's his face? So I don't know, it's pretty crazy. All right, the tragic strike. This is about to be crazy. All right, it's like King's already in battle. I didn't know you had your fucking puppet out. Mel, is that you? All right, let's get back into the reunion. Male looks just like Esterosa. Was I just having a nightmare? I feel like he's still not too far from the Ostorasa we know. Like, when it comes to his past. And yeah, I feel like Mel had a crush on Elizabeth himself. Like, that's why even though he was Ostorasa, he had a crush on him on her again. So Ludote was a good big brother and everything too to him. This is his young days when he was an actual archangel. <laughs> I'm not surprised though with that power that they talking about. Can we get a little showcase of you using it? But Elizabeth, hmm. Uh -huh. Yep, he had a crush on her, even as an angel. And this is when Gother hit it, huh? Hit his memories. Uh, 
Azure. Where did that S Dorsa come from? Why did you take that name? But all right. Like, I know it came from the dog, but I don't know why did he just take it. That's that's so that's literally where the switch up happened. Like that's that's like this is literally where the switch up happened. That's where they hit him, and he started calling himself what the I am Estorosa, and he thought he defeated Mail, and everyone had forgot what Estorosa's what Mail's face looked like, huh? Yeah, you didn't beat nobody. You just turned into <laughs> yeah. That's crazy. And then he just automatically thought that his father, oh, he started to change a little bit. Okay. Cut his hair off and shit. I'm the same as my brother, man. He just automatically started calling himself Meliodas' brother. And his mind just started thinking that this was his, this was what his father told him and gave him the commandment. This is getting, it's getting crazy how they're connecting the story, though. Gother is freaking insane though, like, for Gother to be able to do this shit, that shit is just fucking insane. Even though it costs his life, it's fucking crazy. Alright. This is how the commandment of love Estorosa became to be. But the thing is that he has both memories now. Now he has memories as being Meliodas' brother, and he has memories as being male. So he doesn't even know how who he doesn't know who he's gonna end up being himself. I mean, he's crying like he's an angel. I mean, he's regretting his demon self right now. Gotha did it to you. Okay, so he's gonna have someone to blame. This is actually gonna be crazy then. If he has someone to blame, it's gonna be different. Damn, he's still half demon, half angel right now. And he knows about Gother. I mean, he did do it. Alright, so he's fucking with his angel side. Go through. I know you not. Fin I, I know you could eat all this shit, but I know you're not just finna let him fucking fuck you up like this. All right, this is male, guys. Does he have his grace right now? I think he said his grace was stolen from him. I don't really know yet, but I feel like his power is gonna be somewhere in him. We gonna see though. We gonna see. I ain't gotta even rewind to see what he said. To be honest, though, why did it have to be him? I see. Oh, which means they took Estorosa, which means male, and took him to the demon side. The power balance became. Oh, shit. Oh, the Holy War starting again, which means there's no stopping it. Mm. Still a little different. Was the main was the main reason? Was the main reason? It's a doll. Mop by King, all right. I still want to see if he, I don't know if he has his grace, guys. I don't know if he has his grace. I feel like his grace was taken from him and gave it to, and it's now in King, in, in Escanor. Oh, 
Yeah, he does. I didn't even see him move that fast. Alright, good shit, King. Good shit, King. Man has his power, I think. Gotha actually has feelings and shit. Yeah, he fucking with the king of the fairies right now. Don't play. Still expect King to have shit to do with this fight though, no cap. He ain't going down easy and shit. Damn. Oh me, don't underestimate this nigga. Damn, that's how y'all feeling then. No, that's what I'm saying. Y'all do have y'all alliance and everything. I mean, he has a point. He lost his grace, the sun. And now he's waking when it's the four. Let me go back and read. Let me go back and read what he just said. He lost his grace, the sun. He lost it. And now he has woken as one of the four archangels. He has complete. He has almost complete control over the power of the commandment. He is the most powerful of the archangel, which is exactly why he's able to do that. But at the end, his power of darkness counters our power of God. Every time he leaves, his power is so consumed by darkness. So, okay, the man is still like a, a he's an archangel, but he's being consumed by darkness. They say he doesn't have his grace though. He doesn't have the power of the sun. That shit is gone. Damn. Now it's just getting deep. I don't know what y'all could do. I don't know what's going to happen now. It's just deep. Okay. How y'all going to do that? This man is still dummy strong, though. Like, even though he don't got that power, he dummy strong. <laughs> he's half demon, half angel. That's what it is. Like, and he's about to be. He has the power of the commandment. Like, he don't even got the power of the grace, the sun. Yeah, this man right now is the strongest person here right now. Male is the strongest person here right now. This is not even Estorosa. This is male. He is different. Mm -hmm. He different. He about to fuck y'all up. Y'all better find out how y'all gonna fight this man right now. Y'all allied with us, so let's see how that go. Okay, never. So he's never gonna have that power again, guys. Alright, that's something that I highly doubt, but let's see. I mean, I want to see his reaction to seeing Eskimo with it, though. <laughs> メリオダスが作ってくれたの。私らは宇佐が酔いだくことにはなかった。無駄に<笑> 
She's gonna die. She's gonna die. Dedia is dying. Like, I already, I, I see that shit right now. But yeah, male is strong as shit with all them commandments. Like, yeah, he tough as fuck right now. He's more likely a demon, to be honest. <laughs> Oh shit. I don't know what she got in her mind, but she's about to kill herself, bro. Whatever she got going on. But that power of Gother is fucking OP also. Everyone just knows automatically. Like, we're not gonna ignore that shit. Even though it's old. Hey. Stop playing. Is this her plan? I don't think it's gonna work. Oh, Y'all finna make him mad. Y'all just finna make him mad. I already see it. I don't know. Y'all crying, but Estoros male is about to. I don't know. We're gonna see. I knew it. I just knew it. I just knew it. I think she's really dead, bro. I think she's really dead. Man, using the commandment powers like it's nothing. He better turn into a god, huh? He better be strong as fuck. Wait. She about to see Mon speed. She about to see Mon speed anytime soon, huh? And then she's gonna realize she's dead. Just read it like a fucking book. <laughs> Yeah. Hey, legendary to see cool ass mom speak though. <laughs> he one of the coolest commandments. I ain't gonna lie though. He cool as fuck. Wait, what is you seeing? It's like she's seeing her past. From the demon world from 2000 years ago. Yeah. Mon speed is so cool. Why are they showing this? I can't leave by yourself. Why are they showing this? You tried to tell me those years ago. I see. He was just following you because he fucked with you, bro. That's just it's crazy, bro. Yeah, she's gone. Actually. Actually. Oh, I think she... I don't think it would be in vain. Did she, was she reading her mind or letting have that peaceful moment at the end? I think that's exactly what it was, bro. But she's gone. Let's try to see. No! What the fuck? Hell no! They ain't give me shit! No! No, I ain't get shit! I ain't get shit! It's not fucking funny, bro. I ain't get shit this episode, bro. All I...
bro, man, I knew that, man, Daddy Air dying, that's, bro, fuck, bro, I knew Daddy Air was gonna die when she was doing all that stuff she was doing, that shit's a crazy cliffhanger, but, alright, I don't want no spoilers, obviously, but, I don't know what to expect, the thing is that, we got, Estorosa is now you male. I'm gonna start calling. We gotta start calling him male, right? Like literally, he's using all the commandment powers. Is that literally what he's doing? How many commandments does this man hold right now? Because I know Melioros out here taking commandments, but he's doing the same thing. He's holding commandments. What's good, everybody in the chat? Also, y'all, for just joining in. We just finished the episode. He has four commandments. All right, he has four commandments, and he's starting to use all the commandments power, which is making him this OP right now. That's pretty much insane. I don't know who's gonna be able to stop him at this point. Like. Like, I, I don't know who's going to be able to stop. Meliodas is out here taking six of the other commandments. It's looking like he's going to probably be, have to do something, but they st they're they stopping him from taking commandments right now. Like, Merlin has stopped the shit with going on with Zeldris, Kusak, and Chandler. We still have Bond and Meliodas in Purgatory, but they're in front of the fucking Demon Lord, the Demon King. So I don't know what that's going to bring. Like, I, I don't know what that's going to bring. They're out here talking about mail right now, so... It's a whole different thing going on right now. I'm pretty much, like I do, I'm going to go back on the episode and just look at it again. But the last thing that the Demon King said was, I know exactly, like, it must have been that bastard. Like, he like he knows Gother did it, but like I said, I don't know if he's going to do anything to Gother. He had to do it to, like, for this Demon War or Holy War, but I don't think Demon King give fucks about all that shit. So, yeah, I don't know, y'all. Uh, hopefully I ain't spoiling the comment section, but that's all it and for the YouTube video Like if y'all want to talk more we're gonna be on Twitch. I'm about to read y'all fucking uh, Chat right now. We're gonna talk a little bit, but yeah, y'all that's about it for the video I uh, hope y'all enjoyed it hit that like button and if y'all here watching on Twitch Help me out by hitting that like button when I post this video in a bit. Yeah, y'all ain't finna say too much I catch y'all next video like and y'all peace <laughs>